about to got a deuce. What? Alright, hey everyone, welcome to the first ever preview video about an, uh, actually, uh, the first preview video about anything on my YouTube channel, uh, first preview video. So, this preview video will be about my XOS uh, Roblox operating system. Uh, just a little information about it, it's still in dev, it's still in development currently, so don't expect a lot from this. And also, it's heavily based off uh, the Mac OS X uh, Yosemite design. Anyways, uh, that's all I have to say currently. Uh, actually, I will say this. Heavy criticism, uh, criticism is uh, appreciated. So if you have anything you might want me to change that I'm not already planning to change, then go ahead and uh, put that in the comments down below. So anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get into it. So when I press play... Uh, you can obviously uh, see that nothing has showed up yet. Right now, it's currently waiting 10 seconds because I wanted it to wait 10 seconds for recording purposes. But when an X pops up and it's kind of uh, transparency right here, it's loading up the boo. And I also do apologize for the white around uh, the images or the X or the profile pic. Also, it's loading up the login screen right here. So yeah, I apologize for the white around uh, any image you see. It's just a little Roblox rendering glitch when it comes uh, across a nice little black surface. But anyways, you see that we have a password box here. And this is the right password. But if we typed in not a password, and we press submit a password, please try again. The password That password was incorrect. So if we type in the right password, it... Uh, it Basically, double checks to see if you did not skip the process of entering the password, and it also starts getting ready to load up the desktop. So as you see, it loads up the desktop, and here we are. Welcome to XOS. Now, this is your default. Um, this is your default background. This is not saved. This is not a background that has been saved. It's just the default background everyone starts out with. Now, the reason why there's like no file edit or save or view here or any time the right top right corner it's just because I haven't had the time to add it yet now uh, down here we have the smart manager uh, we have X music and we have settings so let's go ahead and open up settings does a little nice little animation and here we are and as you could see I kind of took some time into making this GUI looks beautiful so uh, here we go let's go ahead and go into overview we can see that we're in XOS Polychrome version 1.0.0, and the startup disk we came from was main hard drive, memory has 8 gigs, and disk, uh, disk space is 500 gigs. Now these two apps, uh, X Music is 12, is uh, 12 megabytes, and Settings is uh, 1 megabyte, currently at least. So we would have, I don't know how uh, how much space we would have left, but I'm going to make a thing where it uh, says how much space you have out of your maximum. In our display tab here, we can go ahead and set our background. So like, let's say we can set our back set a background color to green. You can see it changes to green. Same with the red and orange yellow. We, let's go ahead and set it back to default. Let's go ahead and make a custom background, shall we? So we're going to input a decal and press submit background. Now you may see a problem where uh, you can see the actual game because the image is transparent. Uh, that's something I'm going to fix where it will have a background uh, behind a transparent image. So that's really all we have in the um, XOS settings. Uh, you, uh, more stuff coming to the display soon and same with the overview. So we can go ahead and press the settings icon and exit out of this. The red button would, uh, the exit button would work on it, but I haven't added a function to the settings app only to X Music. Now here, I'm gonna go ahead and lower down my volume because this is actually going to be quite loud. So here we are, we're in X Music, and as you see, uh, we have a play button and two fast forward and back, uh, and slow forward buttons or whatever it's called. Basically, uh, what I'm doing here is that you can only play one. Uh, only one sound which is the one I set for you uh, basically this will change in the future where you can add more to your library of sounds and you can play your own sounds and uh, choose from your library which sound to play so we go ahead and press play you can see that it plays a sound and if we play it again 
it doesn't continue it. It basically just restarts it. So that's something that's going to be changed too. But we can go ahead and exit out of this. So anyways, uh, that's actually XOS quite uh, right there. We're going to do another uh, just uh, thing here. Uh, this is XOS Polychrome, and that's the version name, just uh, saying that. But anyways, uh, I think that's about it for the preview for XOS. Uh, not much to expect here, but uh, more to see in the future. Uh, we'll add the time, might add file up here and add settings to it, and might add a few more apps and add more detail to these two apps. So anyways, uh, that's about it. Thank you guys for watching. Go ahead and leave some criticism if you guys want me to change anything. And that's about it. That's all I have. So if you want to see more of the previews, another preview will probably come out next week for XOS. And if you want to see a tutorial coming out this Saturday, and if you want to see a gameplay video might be coming out uh, whatever this week or Sunday, then go ahead and subscribe. And go ahead and leave a like on this video if you felt this was a cool idea and that I should continue it. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.